Chad here with Jameson's Instagram, here with... Edie McClurg. And Edie, what was your involvement with the project today? Uh, I played a very ancient woman who was uh, getting a little present for someone in the family, and uh, Uma Thurman was the, the lady selling me the, the uh, piece of uh, stuff. All right. Now, the big question. Who gave you your start in the business? Uh, my first on stage uh, outside of Kansas City, which was, you know, high school stuff, uh, I was in San Francisco, and my brother was in an improv group, and uh, uh, he had said that, you know, I was a pretty good actress, and somebody in the group said, well, why don't you do the improvised half of the show? And I said, what would I do? And they said, well, just, you know, this is the way it happens. The, the people who come in for a party and nobody knows anybody and they're all kind of stiff. And, and then somebody passes around a space joint. You know, it's not real joint, but it's a space joint. And then everybody gets real happy and talky and talky. And then everybody falls asleep. And <laughs> that's the way the scene goes. So I said, go to the closet and get something to wear. And I said, so I grab something. I said, no, no, Mary always wears that. Grab something else. So there was this long scarf with a lot of multicolored yarn in it. So I wrapped it around my neck and then we came in and, you know, I was kind of stiff and kind of standing around in the party. And then, uh, and then somebody passes around the space joint and then uh, I started lifting up the scarf with all the multicolored yarn and looking at it and kind of getting into it. The people down front were really laughing at what I was doing. And the director, Ann Bowen, was the wife of Roger Bowen, who was a uh, MASH, the yeah. Colonel Henry Blake in MASH. Um, she was, you know, a really good director, and she said, what were you doing to those people who were laughing? I said, well, you know, we were supposed to be stoned, and I just saw how the, one of the cars were in the scarf, and she went, mm, like that. And then they asked me to join them, and I moved from Kansas City not knowing what was going to happen to me, and I went to San Francisco, and I, just as I arrived in San Francisco, they moved to Los Angeles. So I moved to Los Angeles, it was like, da, 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 you know, and all of a sudden, I, I got into the groundlings and, um, you know, created characters and got onto TV and uh, Carrie was my first film and I was over 30 years old playing a high school senior. But that's good about living in Kansas City and you're not in the sun all the time and, you know, I could... Aging naturally and gracefully. Yes. Yes, absolutely. So after my first year in, in L.A., when I kind of went out and laid in the sun, I kind of looked around and I saw the weathered look of a lot of people and I said, I'm not going to do that anymore. So I just stay out of the sun. <laughs> There's a good tip for everyone. I do that too, but it's more about the weight and me not liking heat. <laughs> I understand that, man. Oh, God, has it been hot lately? It, 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 I work at Disneyland, and I have been. Oh. I, I, I must look like a maniac to those people <laughs> coming in, having a good day, and I'm just sitting there like, "Hey, well, uh, have a magical moment, everybody!" Yeah, magical Ooh. moment. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, and that's... John Lasseter in Disney has been a big deal for me. I just saw, I, I didn't even realize you were in Frozen. I, yeah. I just watched Frozen just recently. Yeah. It's and driving me crazy. the crying mother. Yeah. Because yeah. I think she, he, she, my son is going to be frozen by that woman, you know. And uh -huh. it's like, oh, you know. <laughs> and I'm this little tiny, tiny character at the bottom of the mountain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, how else is uh, what else have you done with John Lasseter? I mean, oh, a bunch of stuff. He's just Wait he's been a champion of mine for ever since I was in the Groundlings, yeah. and uh, I, all of, I got a, a gig for uh, a Bug's Life, okay. and I was yeah, going to be right. Doctor Flora in the in the Bug, bug Colony. Mm -hmm. And uh, I said, I don't remember auditioning for this. And he said, well, you didn't. And I said, well, how did I get the gig? And he said, well, you don't remember me, but I used to come and see you at the Groundlings when I was a tweener. He used to draw in between, yeah. you know, and he lived outside of L.A. Uh -huh. and, and he said I would come down and I would see you 
at the Groundlings, and I told you one night in the lobby that if I ever had a chance to hire you, I would. And I said, was I nice to you? And he said, well, you didn't believe me at all. <laughs> But now I'm hiring you, and he has hired me over and over That's and fantastic. over again. So you never know who's going to show up in your life. Yeah, I, I guess there's worse friends to have than John Lasseter. Oh, baby. <laughs> Pixar and now the head of Disney oh. Animation. Oh, yeah. That's, that's, yeah. You're set. Yeah. <laughs> you're, 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 I noticed Wreck-It Ralph. Yes, I'm in Wreck-It Ralph somewhere. You're one of the uh, townspeople in yes. the game. Yes. Yes, you are. Yes, I. Am. And you know what's funny is I don't even I didn't even need to look at the credits. I flashback. I love that movie. Yes. I'm a big video game nerd. I, I think I'm one of the pink uh, hat ladies. Yes. You're, yeah. That's, there that's you how go. that's how sad it is. I I, I memorize <laughs> these movies so much that I'm like click click click, and there's your voice. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. All right. Well, Good you night. Know Thank you so much for helping us out. It's oh, been, it's been amazing welcome. meeting you. Thank you. Very, <laughs> Thank you. very nice, nice meeting you. Thank, Thank, you. So Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Mike, nice you. Mike you got more than you bargained for. Oh, <laughs> I got more than I could ever ask for. Thank you. Okie dokie. Hey. <laughs>